Hello there, my name is Richard from Silent Peep and today we're having a look at presets in Luminar Neo. I'm going to begin with showing you how to use presets to one-click edit your photos, then after which I will show you how you can save your own edit and adjustments as a preset of your very own for future use. So from the top, let's begin with our photo and then we're going to click on the presets option. Now Right away, Luminar Neo will choose which presets it thinks is best for this photo. So having evaluated this photo, it has chosen easy landscapes, artistic and scenery. So I'll begin with easy landscapes, but if you preferred, you can go through any preset collection that you like. So easy landscapes and long exposure. Now that one's a bit much. So what we can do is simply click through the various presets until we find one that we like the look of. Now I quite like clean light, so I'm gonna keep that. I can also add it to my favorites by clicking on this heart option or de-clicking it indeed. But overall, I am happy and that's it. I'm done, this photo's finished and I can move on to the next one. But what if I want to save my own adjustments as a preset? So let's shift into the edit tag and just to keep things fair I'm going to revert this photo back to its original out of camera state. Next I'm going to begin my edit. So I will start with a bit of structure AI. Just give it a bit of definition and then a little bit of an enhance AI and accent and a little bit of sky. And just for fun a bit of a big net. And there we go. So if we look at that and the original, we can see we've come a long way quite quickly. But nevertheless, I did have to put some work in. And next time I don't, because what I'm gonna do is save this as a preset. So I'm gonna click on save as preset. That brings up the my presets option on the right. And here we have my presets three. So I'm gonna type in a name, I'm gonna call it beached. And I'm going to click on this little arrow here. Oh, and it still says my preset free. I'm going to rename that again. I must have done something wrong. There we go. That's better. And then what I can also do is I can mark it as a favorite. And of course, I can rename it and delete it and even show it in Explorer and use it to import it to different copies of Luminar Neo. The reason why I marked it as a favorite, if I return back to presets, I have this favorites tab here, and then I've got the ones that I've allocated, including beached. But now I can click through all my favorites, including the ones I've created, to find out which best suits the image that I'm working with. As it turns out, I like the one I created most. So anyway, I hope that was useful. If you've yet to try Luminar Neo, uh, please do so. It's absolutely free. Link in the description below. If you can't seem to do what I'm doing with your copy of Lean, Luminar Neo, it's because you've not updated it. The original version did not allow you to save your own presets. So if you right click on Luminar Neo, go to help and check for updates. It'll have a quick look and just make sure you're on the latest version, which as of this moment is 1.07, but that's likely to change quite soon. Anyway, hope that was useful. My name's Richard from Silent Peak and I wish you the best of days. Bye-bye.